Welcome back to the channel. So I'm pretty excited about showing you this Bible that I got with me right here. This is the ESV Heirloom Bible Thin Line Edition in Horween Leather. Are you ready? Check it out with me. All right, so here is the Bible, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful looking uh, Horween Thin Line ESV Bible. So I think that's called Ghosting, uh, the print. I think, I don't know. Uh, Holy Bible, ESV, English Standard, Crossway. Gorgeous looking Bible, super soft. This, this Harween leather Bible is gorgeous, man. I love it. I really do enjoy this. Uh, it does have perimeter stitching, which is great, ladies and gentlemen. It is also smite sewn, and as you guys can already see, it does have some gold gilding. Um, and when you open up the Bible, you'll see that it's got that like dark uh, salmon. I call it salmon. Others say it's red. Uh, I say it's salmon. I don't know. I could be wrong. But it goes beautiful. It really does go beautiful with the brown Horween leather. Guys, the leather on these Bibles are super soft. People have said that, you know, other Bible reviewers have said that it, they come stiff. Uh, and with time, it wears. It wears out and gets floppy. Uh, in my case, my Bible came out pretty floppy. I found this Bible for about a week. All right, I just wanted some time with it so I can get to know this Bible. Um, it's going to have four raised tubs, ladies and gentlemen. Four raised tubs. It is edge line. It's got two ribbons, guys. It's got two ribbons. And uh, it is smite sewn, all right? Now, Crossway has been known for not giving us good ribbons. You know, they're kind of uh, single-sided satin. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. They're double-sided satin. But I don't know, man. The quality, the... The look of it, I don't know. I don't know. It's just something that's never been that pleasing to my eye, personally. You may like them. Uh, this Bible is edge line, ladies and gentlemen. And he, you're going to have a couple of white pages here. Holy Bible. All right. It is printed in the Netherlands, which I know a lot of people like. Me, personally, I really enjoyed the China uh, Bibles that were printed in China. I really did like those. The paper was pretty thick. I mean, it wasn't the greatest paper, but but you're going to see what I mean right now. Uh, this is double column. Double column Bible. Look at this. What, what can you see? What can you see? Focus. What can you see? This Bible is not line match. It's not line match. Why not? Crossway, I know you guys are going to watch this video because I'm going to send it to you guys. But why is this Bible not line match, ladies and gentlemen? This Bible, listen, this Bible retails so that you guys can see for your own eyes. This Bible retails at $349.99. $350, ladies and gentlemen. $350. Why is this Bible not line match? Now, now, that's... Really the only complaint I have that it's not line match. Uh, it is my zone, which I love. Very well done. I love that. I mean, for $350, yeah, it better be well done. And it is very well done. It is Smite Sun, unlike other Bibles, not from Crossway, but from other companies that very nice Bibles, but most of them are not Smite Sun, and then they're falling apart, but they still want to charge a good penny. This one is very well done. Beautiful paper, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful, soft paper. I love it. I love it. It's not line match. However, however, it is great looking paper, guys. And the camera will always catch a little extra ghosting that what normally is. I want you guys to know that right now. All right. I want you guys just to know that. Um, it is not verse by verse. Okay. It's not verse by verse. We do have two columns. There are no references only footnotes okay it's a it's a thin line bible there are no uh book introductions anything like that let me show you all you're gonna get is that right there my friends that's all you will get in this bible and that's the way the whole bible is if i'm honest with you it feels good in the hand it's great to handle um i've had this bible i think i said it already because this is like my fourth take um, but I did have, I've had this Bible for about uh, a week now. I used it to preach last Sunday because I think I got it on Saturday. And so, I mean, this thing feels good in the hand, super soft. The Horween leather is going to show some wear with time, which is amazing, guys, because it looks so cool, man. All right, so here we have the Psalms. 
the poetic sections, which are verse by verse. We get to the New Testament. And voila. All right, so when it comes to the print, the font size, this is an 8 point font ladies and gentlemen 8.5 something i forgot to tell you guys so the height of this bible is about an an 8.3 8.4 and the width of it is a 5.3 as well so so it's nice guys it's nice it's lightweight it's thin again uh the font the point font here is going to be an eight uh i do like that the verses are bold they are a little bolder than the actual text itself all right, just want you guys to know that. Uh, but like I said earlier, ladies and gentlemen, this is really what you get in this Bible. Very nice. Well, uh, it is a very nice looking Bible. Feels good in the hand, if I'm honest with you. Great uh, Smythe Zone. Uh, you're going to have the concordance at the very end. A lot of people don't like a concordance. I love them. I've said it in the past. I really, really do like the concordance. And then we come to the map section right here. Look at this. Uh, maps are printed on some nice papers. All right. Ooh, look at this, guys. Forgot to tell you about this. Look at that. So it's a very nice looking Bible. And you have some extra white sheets at the very end, which is great. You can make some notes. Over the, over the last couple of months, I've seen some people put uh, uh, on Facebook, they've placed some, uh, what do you call it? What you gonna call it? What you gonna call it? Like Bible verses. And when you guys go out to evangelize. So this is one of those cool Bibles. It's going to have some thick paper that you can make some notes on. And if you're going to take it out to evangelize, hey, go for it, man. Because this Bible looks awesome. Feels awesome. With time, it will show somewhere, which is great. That's the best part, man. It's great looking Bible. Again, uh, the whole, you know, hey, it's not line match. That's really... All uh, that's really my my little pet peeve there, but it is on some great paper, and because it does have some very nice and great paper, you're not go it. The ghosting will really not bother you, if I'm honest with you. It really won't bother you. I already preached from it. I really didn't have an issue with it. It was great. The camera, like I said earlier, will catch a little extra ghosting that what normally is. I love how this Bible is built and how it feels. Man, this is a beautiful Bible, right? It's a gorgeous looking Bible. I told you you would like it. And if you want to purchase it, click down in the description. I'm going to have uh, the website where you can go and you can purchase it from there. I'm telling you, this is a beautiful looking Bible. Guys, Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. God bless you. Have a great one. And I'll see you in my next video. Well, you'll see me in the next video. Bye.